What's up guys, this is just a super quick lesson today. I'm gonna to show you how to play Florence and the Machines version of You Got Love, all right? Really simple, three chords for the whole thing. There's just a few rhythms to learn, all right? So put the cap on fret three to start with, okay? Now the three chords are simple. E minor, D, A. That's the whole song. So the only thing we have to worry about are the rhythms, okay? There's kind of one main rhythm. I'm just gonna show you how to vary the dynamics of the song so it doesn't sound the same for the whole thing. So let's look at the chords first. If you know these chords, then skip ahead to the rhythms. So E minor, you just wanna play open E. Obviously in relation to the capo, open E. Middle finger, second fret, third finger, second fret. Open G, open B, open E, all right? Quite good, simple beginner chord there, just two fingers, right? For D, we're gonna have open A, open D, we're gonna have first finger, second fret on the G string, third finger, third fret on the B string, and the middle finger, second fret on the E string. Okay, sometimes I, I strum before I bring that down, so I hammer it on. That sounds quite nice. Same with the A, uh, a chord here. That sounds quite nice too, you can do it there. So for the A chord, we have open A again. We have middle finger, second fret on the D string, third finger, second fret on the G string, fourth finger, second fret on the B string. It's quite hard to squeeze them all into one fret, so you can move your, you've got all of this space, okay, in between the two frets here to get the same sound, watch. So only when you cross over that it changes. So just bring the middle finger right over then you've got room for the other fingers. Okay, also we don't want the low E string for this particular chord. So just bring the thumb down, rest it on the string, and then it won't vibrate for very long, all right? That means you can just strum everything. You don't have to worry about hitting the right strings. Now that's the other thing on it. Before we get into the rhythms, Notice that sometimes I slide the fourth finger over. A sus, A major, A sus, A major. Okay, so you can hammer it on. Right, with the D string. You can hammer on the middle finger if you want. So, the rhythm is simple, okay, let's just jump to the chorus rhythm and I'll show you how to strip it down for the other part, so. Right, for those of you that want to kickstart your guitar learning abilities so that you can perform one day, potentially make money and travel playing the guitar just like me, then click the link in the description, also in the comment section, and sign up to my premium lessons on my website, alright, and we'll get you started right away learning the guitar for real. So let me slow this down. Just work on one chord for this. Down, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down, down, up, 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 down, up, down, down. Okay, when you're comfortable with that, then we can practice changing chords, all right? Now bear in mind with this rhythm, I always move the hand to the B. 
Okay, so make sure you're doing that. Don't just play down, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up. Don't just try and move it quickly. Keep this hand moving to a B. So down, down, up, 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 down, up, down, up, down. You see that? Down, up, 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 down, up, down, up. Always to a B. You can do this with any rhythm you practice. Just make sure your hands always, even if it's really fast. You see it's still moving. It's quite, it has to move it quickly, but it's still making sure that the downs and the ups are in the right place. All right. So let's have a good changing chords and doing this. So on my count, one, two, three, four. change you can change on the last the very last down up that's when I change so it's like down down up 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 down up down up down up down up down up 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 down up down up down up 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 down up down up down so I sort of change to good I'm changing within that time frame of the last down up all right So, that's the chorus rhythm, that's, we're going to base everything off that rhythm, okay? It's quite a basic rhythm, very simple. Now, for the first part of the song, we can just do one strum, so we can play... Sometimes I feel like throwing my hands up in the air I know I can count on you Sometimes I feel like saying, Lord, I just don't care You got the love, I need to see me through So when we get to this louder verse, the drums kick in. Then we can have the strumming, but just try and do it quietly. You know, you don't want it to sound the same volume as the chorus. The chorus wants to be big. So make sure this verse is when food is gone. You can sing loudly, but just make sure you strum quietly. And then you can sort of build up to the chorus. Do you see what I mean? The chorus can be really loud, and then the verse is just sort of more averagey. All right. Um, another option for the verse, you can just play. miss out part of the rhythm just so it feels like there's less going on okay I do that sometimes but usually just I just play the same thing quietly now this is obviously Florence is a woman so she sings this an octave higher than I'm singing it right now I'm singing it super low it sounds very boring um, so if you're a guy you know it's probably it might not be the best song if you're gonna sing um, but it's fun to play along to and obviously you can still sing it an octave lower or you can get a girl singer to sing along with you an octave higher all right so I hope this lesson was helpful super quick super easy you just got three chords and uh, one rhythm basically all right so thanks for watching guys see you in the next one